I'm going to show you the best way to remove dental plaque from your teeth. Plaque is a biofilm of microbes, essentially a calcium shell around a group of microbes that protects them. Plaque is a primary cause of gingivitis, bad breath and tooth decay, and it's not just due to lack of brushing or flossing. Even with regular brushing and flossing, plaque can still form. Here's why. Your mouth harbors the second largest group of microbes in your entire body, with hundreds or even thousands of different species. Most of these microbes are commensal, meaning they live in a neutral, non-harmful relationship with you. These friendly microbes help keep harmful fungi like candida in check. If you kill these friendly microbes, it can lead to an overgrowth of fungi, causing conditions like oral thrush. Plaque develops when the relationship with these microbes turns pathogenic due to stresses like poor diet, high sugar intake, smoking, alcohol and antibiotics. Even chemicals in mouthwash, such as chlorhexidine and fluoride in toothpaste and water, can mimic antibiotic effects, increasing acidity and the risk of decay. Fluoride, which has been used for 60 years, lacks randomized controlled studies to back its safety in water supplies. The FDA recognizes fluoride as a drug, and it's not pharmaceutical grade in water supplies. It's actually a hazardous byproduct from phosphate fertilizer companies. Surprisingly, no major health or regulatory organization like the ADA, FDA, CDC or EPA oversees fluoride regulation. It's managed by a private entity. This highlights the importance of using water filters that remove fluoride. To combat dental plaque, avoid fluoride-containing toothpaste and consider making your own or using fluoride-free options. The root cause of plaque is the transformation of neutral microbes into pathogenic ones due to stress. Addressing this involves reducing stresses and reintroducing beneficial microbes into your mouth. You can buy oral probiotics or consume probiotic-rich foods like sauerkraut, kimchi and kefir regularly. Additionally, using xylitol gum can help. These new friendly microbes will compete with and reduce the pathogenic ones, improving your oral health. Now if you have liked this video, hit subscribe.